let's combine any of your voice memos on your iPhone. Now let's open up the voice memo app and say you recorded two different voice memos and you want to combine them into one. There's no way to do it in the voice memo app itself. That's just not an option to combine the two. So of course you can always just send both voice memos and send them both as an email or something like that. But if you really want to combine them, you have to use a third party service. So I'm going to tap edit at the top right here and then tap on both of these recordings and then tap share at the bottom left. Now you can see here, I can share it with different things and I'm gonna share it with InShot, which is a service, a third party video and audio editor. And it says import files as music. I'm gonna hit okay. You can use any different audio mixer, GarageBand, iMovie, or any third party audio mixer to be able to combine these two songs or uh, voice memos together. So let's tap on video here and I'm just going to hit new and just choose a blank video. And then once I'm here, I can tap music at the bottom left and then I'm going to tap music again. And you can see here, I have an imported option. I'm going to tap that and you can see here are my two different imported audios or uh, voice memos. I can tap use on this one. And then I'll just do the same steps again, import it and tap on the second one. So now you can see I have these two different voice memos on here and all I have to do is take my finger and drag them together. Sometimes it's a little buggy. There we go, drag them together and then you can have both of those together and seamlessly transition between one voice memo and the other and then just hit the check mark here and export at the top right and you can export that. This is technically meant usually for videos, but if you use any audio editor, garage band or something like that, you should be able to just export it as audio. Um, but you can always tap at the top right here and then just choose format and then switch over to MP4 if you want to and then hit save and that will save it to your camera roll gallery. Hope this helps. Thanks for your time today and I'll see you on the next one.